Parents and their kids might have to be a little more patient when it comes to treating ear infections in children. The American Academy of Pediatrics is updating its treatment guidelines. Parents can't wait for their kids to get back to smiling and playing when their little ones are sick. Just watching and waiting for them to get better is hard, but that's part of new guidelines for treating ear infections. Everybody wants their child to be well, so do we. Dr. Eric Yancey has been treating children for 34 years. He explains how the American Academy of Pediatrics is clarifying its 2004 guidelines to watch and wait before treating ear infections with antibiotics. Now they're, they're saying they want the, the actual guidelines for diagnosis to be more stringent in that they want us to make sure that there is an actual ear infection. Yancey says ear infections are one of the most common ailments pediatricians diagnose and are commonly not actual ear infections. He explains that watching and waiting about three to five days to see if the so-called infection resolves itself really does work. However, he says in the meantime, parents can treat their kids with pain relievers and keep their heads elevated. No, I think they should give you, go on and give you the antibiotics first. And I think um, that way it'll knock everything out as soon as possible. We have parents that actually believe that the child got better within minutes to hours after taking an antibiotic. It just couldn't happen that fast. The guidelines recommend waiting to treat with antibiotics so our children don't become resistant to medicines. However, the guidelines say children should be given antibiotics immediately in some cases, like when the infection is severe or in both ears in infants.